Hello again, everybody. How are you? Uh, today, I would like to talk about DJing. You know, wicka, 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 wick. Um, contrary to popular belief, uh, this is actually an incredible art form and a part of what makes hip hop so dynamic. Uh, these days, you know, you'll see a lot of uh, people calling themselves DJs and they will just be putting two sounds together or working off of a computer. But <clears throat> if you've ever been privy, to see uh, an actual artist on turntables, it's very impressive. Uh, just as impressive as it is to see anyone doing a guitar solo. For instance, I encourage you to look up uh, the DJ Qbert or DJ Shadow or Cut Chemist. These are DJs who use the turntables as pure instruments. I mean, these are people who some say even can speak to aliens through their through their vinyl. Uh, their cuts and their scratching. So the general techniques are called uh, beat juggling and of course as I just mentioned scratching but beat juggling is one of the techniques that only the true experts can do. They take two different records uh, both with the same beat on it and lay them out on a table and they use the fader in between and also the mixer and they go in between both record and they make the beat sound like it is collectively playing just by the timing of their hands going back and forth back and forth just using their hands and if you see this in concert it's the type of thing that is just as impressive as anything else you can see musically I mean it's it's incredible to watch and it's something that every single time puts shivers down my spine when I see it live I definitely recommend going onto YouTube looking up DJ Qbert He's a Bay Area native, so is DJ Shadow, and seeing what they have to offer because you will definitely be impressed and you'll probably find some very good tunes out of it too. Thank you. Have a good one.